All right, so I want to speak a little bit more on Pedro Espinosa. Now, Pedro Espinosa, from my perspective, is not really a bad person. Um, I don't view Pedro Espinosa as being a bad person. I view Pedro Espinosa as being a 18th Street gang member. And 18th Street has had an issue with the Rolling Twenties Bloods for a long time, since the 1990s. And there's a lot of 18th Street gang members who come on YouTube and say, "Oh, fuck slobs, and we hate slobs, and we'll kill slobs," and they and and they mean that. They mean that. But I want to go a little bit deeper. Pedro Espinosa might not have actually shot Jamil Shaw, and I'm not saying that trying to get Pedro Espinosa off death row or get him out of prison. I'm saying that realistically. How do we know that a crip didn't do it or some other? gang member didn't do it or somebody who had nothing to do with the gang just killed them and Pedro Espinosa they say Pedro Espinosa was bragging about killing Jamil Shaw what 18th street gang member wouldn't brag about killing a 20 a rolling 20s blood any 18th street gang member from 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 uh he Pedro from El Sayas double A's but what 18th street gang member from his from from his clique from that area in South Central wouldn't brag about that. That's what gang members do: is brag about brag about uh, fucking up the enemies. And I I respect uh, Jamil Shaw's family and respect Jamil Shaw and his father. It's a gang. It was gang activity, but the news media the news media made it look like Pedro Espinosa killed Jamil Shaw on the simple fact that Jamil Shaw was black and Pedro didn't kill Pedro. Pedro might not even did it. He even said he didn't do it. But, you know, his testimony is, is testimony. All they had was testimony. They had testimony from Pedro Espinosa's alleged nephew or alleged cousin, and that's how they convicted him. But Pedro said he didn't do it. They didn't have any physical evidence. But what 18th Street gang member isn't going gonna, isn't gonna to say something like that? When I was a teenager, I was I was I was an I was an 18th Street gang member, and I still talk to the 18th Street gang. I'm not a criminal. I don't commit crimes, but I still talk. I talk to Crips. I talk. I even if, if somebody was a blood and they said Jamil, I have to talk to you about something. I would I would listen to what they had to say. I don't I, I don't I don't go around. I don't care what you are, but they want to make Pedro Espinosa out to be some sort of hardcore racist gang man. That ain't Pedro Espinosa. Pedro Espinosa has black friends. Pedro Espinosa, there's black women who like Pedro. Pedro, Pe, if, if I'm telling you, there was a black, I know a black woman who is friends with him. I, there's a black woman who doesn't, who wants him off death row. I know her. She likes him. Women find him attractive. Like me, I can never get the kind of women he can get. Uh, BK Dark, Pedro, Pedro Espinosa can get any kind of woman he wants to get because women find him like attractive how he looks and all that stuff and and I, I think it's a cool thing man Pedro's cool he can get all types of girls and stuff like that Pedro's smart and they're trying to make him look like like he's racist and stuff and he probably he might not like black you know what I mean it's a lot of Hispanic people who don't like black people in, in, in California because of how some black people come across. Some black people make too much noise. You know what I'm saying? As, as other black people who don't like black people. You know? But I'm speaking up on Pedro Espinosa not to disrespect Jamil Shah, disrespect Jamil Shah's family, which I respect. Jim My father's black. I'm, I'm black and white. I'm mixed. Had I been killed, ha had somebody, had, some ha had I been Jamil Shah and somebody would have killed me, I would want my father to do something about it. See, you see what I'm saying? So I'm speaking for real, for real. But on Pedro Espinosa, I'm just aggravated that there's all these videos about him being racist and about him. Like, it's all these people on YouTube talking bad about They don't even know Pedro Espinosa. They're not from 18th Street. They don't know Pedro Espinosa. Like, if, if you don't know Pedro Espinosa or you're not from 18th Street, you don't have a right to sit there and talk bad about Pedro Espinosa like that. Like, he was convicted for a crime. You know, whether he did it or not, people want to sit there and badger Pedro Espinosa and talk about him bad all over the country. They don't even know. They'd be scared of Pedro Espinosa. I think, how you doing, ladies? Hey. But I think, in all reality, 
in all reality, I think they'd be scared of Pedro Espinosa. If Pedro, if Pedro Espinosa walk up to somebody, they'd be scared of Pedro Espinosa because Pedro Espinosa hit you in your mouth. I ain't playing. Pedro Espinosa from El Sayas Click, from um down there. Pedro Pedro Espinosa from 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 18th Street. Pedro Espinosa hit you. People from 18th Street just hit you in your mouth, and and that's what I'm saying. They don't understand. 18th, like 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 I live in Michigan. Mexican people in Michigan try to act black and talk black and all that stuff. They don't do that. People from 18th Street are like me. Like you see how proper I speak and how I talk. People from 18th Street aren't scared of black. Like 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 Pedro Espinosa could have beat Jamil Shaw up with his fist. Pedro Espinosa's tough. Pedro Espinosa, matter of fact, Pedro Espinosa was in was in juvenile hall in the in the in the, ju, in the youth correction facility whooping people's asses. He was he was beating black people up in the juvenile hall. Pedro Espinosa could whoop somebody's ass with his fist. He doesn't have to Pedro Espinosa isn't a coward that has to walk up to some black person shooting. Pedro Espinosa can walk up to somebody and, be, and, 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 and take off on them and hit them in their mouth and whoop their motherfucking ass. Pedro Espinosa don't give a fuck. Pedro Espinosa Pedro Espinosa get out of the car and beat your motherfucking ass in the middle of the street like you're a bitch. That's, they got Pedro Espinosa fucked up. You know what I'm saying? They're on YouTube talking about Pedro Espinosa, a racist gang member, he's a coward and all that shit. Pedro Espinosa will walk up in a motherfucking liquor store and beat the brakes off your ass. And that's what I want people to remember.